everyone, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. So before we get into the video, I um, just wanted to say, so in the morning, I leave pretty early for my job. I leave around 6.45, so I leave pretty early. I have the Corsa Extreme exhaust with the double X bite non-active exhaust, and it's pretty loud. So I can't change the pitch and the tone of the exhaust so it's quieter when I leave my house. So I thought of an idea. How do I make it quieter in the morning when I try to leave my house? So I saw this genius idea. Well, why don't we just stuff the exhaust with some old raggedy t-shirts like that. Stuff it right there. And then we'll put this guy right here in this one. Go like this. And we start it up. It should be muffled and quiet, right? Makes perfect sense. Let's try it. All right, here we go. Nope. All right, so in all seriousness, I saw someone do that online and uh, I think they honestly thought that was going to help. So I just wanted to, <laughs> who would think that would, oh, let's throw some t-shirts in the exhaust. That'll, uh, that'll work. That'll quiet it down. People. All right, so in all seriousness, that's not what today was about. That was just something stupid for fun. I wanted to do, I guess, just to show how pointless it is. But today, uh, it is a gorgeous day. We're about 60 degrees. There's a cold front coming through here, so I wanted to take advantage of today. I'm gonna drive out to Eagle Canyon Raceway. I've driven out there before. It's a lot of nice country back roads, so we're, I'm gonna do a nice back road country drive. There's a lot of nice twists and turns. Uh, it's not too warm, obviously. We're about 60, but it's not cold, so we're kind of like in between there. So gonna take advantage of the day, do a nice POV drive uh, out there. I'm pretty sure the track is open, so there should be some cars there on the track, so we I'm gonna go and uh, check that out and uh, enjoy the drive out there and the drive back. So let's go. drive out here let me roll the window up it's always a nice drive out in this area so eagle canyon raceway is just right over that ridge over there just right over that way but uh just super nice day and this is about a half hour from where i live so it's not that far and the drive out here is just 
it's always nice it's just a lot of nice back roads and uh on a day like today, I decided to take advantage of it. All right, so we're here at Eagle Canyon. Not a whole lot of cars going, but there's there's a there's a Porsche right there. A couple others over here. So. Looks like they are doing some courses on the track, but it is kind of on the chillier side, but. Jacob, Italian Stein, if you're watching this. Looks like. Someone's already got your name, buddy. Full blown track car. That's awesome. All right, so plans 2024 coming up for my 2022 GT. First and foremost, I gotta get some better tires. Uh, drag tires front and rear especially and then a better daily driver tire if I even want to do track events here at a track like this I just need a better tire the factory P zeros are uh, not that fantastic I've made that clear multiple times if you want to do anything barely over stock track events on a road course these just won't cut it so first things i'm going to be getting some tires um, and then from that point on i'm either going to go possibly nitrous coming up in 2024 here or this year i might just go straight na and then add some kind of spray whether that's nitrous express or something and then i'm either going to go turbo like i said or supercharge haven't quite made up my mind yet but that is my 2024 2025 plans coming Forward. So if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do me a favor. Make sure to hit the red subscribe and follow along. I post at least once a week as often as I can. So make sure you hit subscribe. All right. So this is inside their garage here. I think you could store your cars here or they have a car. I'm not really sure how it works, but they got some nice ass cars here. BMW, some Porsches. It's super clean, super nice. Or you could rent these. I'm not 100% sure. I don't come here often enough. All right, so I was anticipating potentially more people, more cars here today, but it's probably because, uh, well, it's January and uh, not a lot of people race, I guess, in January. But anyway, I thought I was hoping for at least more since it is such a nice day but uh we're gonna go head back drive back i was just hoping for a little bit more activity but there's not much so we're gonna go do the rest of the drive heading back on some back roads that guy though he's got the right idea <laughs> it's just So do me a favor, drop a comment. Let me know what kind of variety of content you guys would like to see here in 2024, spring, summertime. Uh, would you like to see obviously more drag strip events, more POV style drives like I'm doing today? Uh, what kind of stuff would you uh, guys like to see on the channel? Please drop a comment and let me know and uh, I will do the best I can to bring you guys what you guys would like to see. If anybody wants to get rid of some evidence to a crime, uh, dispose of a body, whatever, out in an area like this, you probably get away with it. You're uh, got a lot of open area, open country. Texas has a lot of that, so uh, you got some options. But on that note, I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna close this one out. If you guys are watching and you're not subscribed, please do me a favor, hit subscribe. Drop a comment, let me know the content going forward that you guys would like to see in 2024. Uh, on that note, you guys have a good one, and I will see you guys in the next one. I'll see ya. Bye.